Yo, what's up, guys? It's Savvy. I'm back. Ain't got a webcam this time, though, because all, all my cameras are garbage. Y'all can see that from the other tutorials. I mean, it's pretty obvious. Freaking laptop camera looks like a joy. Anyways, let's hop right into this. We got a Lincoln tutorial right here. We got some chords. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably more notes than you need, but I mean, it, it sounds nice. I'm using the JV1080 plugin EP mod pad piano and but you can use purity like the pretty suitcase the tomorrow e piano yeah stuff like that but this is what that sounds like simple four bar loop then we hop into the next one we got purity bell with harmonics gotta have this Okay, next we got this uh, partial sound in the fast synth. You've probably heard that before, um, but all it does is. So very simple. Next we have a bell. It's very repetitive, but that's the for you bell, I think. What's it called? Yeah, the delay for you. And then the next one, we got the vibra, yeah, the vibra hand bell. Also, OG plug sound. So with all the melodies together. Like, you can hear how simple that is. Lincoln is very simple with his beats. Like, honestly, drums, sometimes he really only uses a clap, a hi-hat, and an 808, and he's done. But here, I've got, obviously, more than that. So if we hop into the drums, I'm going to keep the melodies here. The hi-hat's very simple, except he has been using, like, rolls lately in his hats, so... <laughs> Also, a quick little tip, I've been using this little loop bar. It just makes the whole beat making process go like 10 times faster. So, I mean, without it, don't loop. All we have is this, and then I have to like either copy it over or make more notes. But if I'm fine with the loop how it is, I'll just um, hit this, bar, uh, this button up here and then set the loop to bar, and it's that simple. Everything repeats over. So with Lincoln, soft hi-hat sound, and also soft like high pitch plug and B clap. Hi. Okay, next we got the 808. Of course, he um, uses the freaking stupid cool 808 a lot. So what I got here is so it's it's kind of quiet but at the same time it's it's got its presence for sure So, okay, next, just a simple snare. Add some bounce. OG crash. And then, not, not gonna lie, um, these last three things are kind of more 30 Nick based, but like, sounds good in the beat. So we got this little open hat. And then we got this chant. And then uh, the stupid cool stick rim. I don't know what we call those, yeah. As 
you can see, very simple. Lincoln beats are very, very simple. Like, I nah, do. Make a beat in five minutes, boom, you're done. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna arrange this like a leak and beat now. Alright, so we're back. I got some stuff arranged. Um, he does this little, like, pitch down in the beginning for a lot of his beats, and then it goes up to the regular pitch. Um, th this. Okay, so the easiest way in my brain to do this is I just like select eight bars or yeah and then I go on over to Edison put it to on play sync the tempo and then I hit record and then I hit play and then I just let it play out then I drag it out and then what I do is I put the mode right here on stretch put the range to four drag the pitch down a little bit about like a hundred cents and then this is the result we get the 808 um, yeah, it, it's kind of overpowering in the recording because I recorded it badly, but this is just for example, so it's like... <laughs> So yeah, essentially that's it. I'm going to go through a quick, quick little um, mixing thing. This uh, master I got out of the Glumboy kit. Shout out to Glumboy. That dude is a goat. Okay, where's the Glumboy? There it is. Okay, so Glumboy master. Then I chose the Dro one because Lincoln, yeah, it's just more plug, not plug and B. Um, for the chords, I just added a little EQ to get rid of the bass, get rid of the low end. Um, nothing there. Just some stereo, some stereo, of course, because I abuse stereo. Um, with the uh, 808, all I did was turn the stereo knobs all the way to the right, so it's, like, not stereo. What is, what, uh, what is that? What? I Okay, I don't know words, but, like, that make thing go, yeah. Um, and then I panned it a little bit right, because the 808 sounded like it was panned a little left. And then the rest is just... 